Good evening guys, uh, Carlos here, Pit Special, and I got my stock Radian, as you can see, it's completely stock, it's got the, <clears throat> the old uh, markings, except of course the fuse, this fuse is brand new, the old fuse is way over there, as you can see, it's been through hell and back, so I got this new fuse here, uh, not too long ago, I kind of reinforced it with some, um, uh, mylar tape uh actually the the ones that they use over there at the the sign uh print shop uh it has done well for me for many applications for foam uh it goes all the way up to here as you can see this is a good breakage point um uh, if you pull up real hard <laughs> if you lose signal all of a sudden you're holding up this is where it breaks and that's where that one the way i show you broke up and um uh, not that it can't be repaired, it's just that, you know, uh, either after the repair, either the wing gets in kind of real tight or too loose. So it depends on how you repair it and if you're watching why it cures. This is a new foam, this is a new fuse, rather, and uh, no issues with that, of course. So this is my typical marking here, of course. And here is the innards. It's pretty much stock it's it's no mystery here okay but everybody's having issues with the new or some radians that are coming this propeller here uh, I had the stock in a bag uh, this propeller there was a, an alert soon after the radian was introduced a couple years ago and it asked for uh, for people to call in and uh, you know tell them that you know you have a radian and uh, that they sent you free of charge brand new propeller and I did my buddy on the other hand never did and he has never had issues with the propeller I believe a lot of people were using uh, a little too many cells and high full throttle and uh, I believe the propeller broke somewhere around here the stock this one on the other hand is very thick and to come to the chase, somebody asked me on the thread to see if I could move the uh, propeller side to side. Now, I don't know how I'm going to do this because I'm holding the, the phone. But, yeah, it moves side to side. Uh, centrifugal force will keep it nice and steady. There's no vibration, really, because of this. Uh, I believe uh, it, you call that a slop or, or some kind of slop. But, see that? Okay. And, and, you know, forces are such that when this thing is spinning, it's going to keep this prop right there and, and no more slop. So I don't think the vibrationist vibrations are cause of that. I believe there's something else here. Maybe the piece in here, the plastic hub behind the spinner. There's many, many reasons why. But... From my conversations to the gentleman that's having the issue, uh, he swapped the propeller from a known radian that did not have the vibration, and he installed it on his, and he did not have any more vibration. So I believe the issue here is the actual prop itself. Somehow the mold, manufacturing process, all you need is air pockets in here, and that will cause it to vibrate uh, pretty forcefully. Uh, if you don't have a, a balanced prop, it, it will cause you a lot of issues. So that's my theory, but I just want to give you a heads up that uh, this is not the problem. Uh, my Radian uh, spins super quiet. Okay, see you guys later and hope this helps.